We're moments away from the red carpet arrivals here at the Met Gala, better known as Fashion Super Bowl. So Andrew, tell us about the exhibit this year. It's called Heavenly, Bod <laughs> Heavenly Bodies, <laughs> Fashion in the Catholic Imagination. Yes. Um, and it's the largest show we've actually put on at the Met. It's um, 25 galleries and 60,000 square feet. Mm -hmm. And it's, um, it's arranged as a pilgrimage. So it starts off at the Met Fifth Avenue with the, in the visiting galleries. Mm -hmm. It goes to the medieval galleries and then the Anna Winter Costume Center and then the Met Glories in Fort Tryon Park. But it really looks at the influence of Catholic imagery and symbolism on, mm -hmm. on high fashion much let's go and see the imagination which is happening on the red carpet here at the gala thank you Why this subject this season? Why? Well, we, we always try to, uh, to come up with an idea that has a contemporary sort of relevance or resonance. And over the last few years in particular, the debates around art and religion have been very heated. Art and religion, fashion and religion. And open up that conversation as well. So, Donatella Versace plays a big deal in this. Tell her about the marriage between the two, the Met and Donatella. She's extraordinary. There's a long tradition of, G of Versace engaging with uh, Catholic symbolism and iconography. This is the hallway where all the stars are going to be gracing before they go into the temple.
And how long does something like this take to put together? Well, we, uh, this one, um, we began working with the Vatican two years ago. Yes. And it took 12 visits to, the, to secure the loans. Yes. Uh, but it, it didn't really take momentum until probably um, just when the Ray Karakuba show came down, which yes. was uh, in, in June. Yes. So it's been probably about nine months in the making. This is in two locations. We're here at the Met, but it's also at the Cloisters as well. It is. And the Cloisters, um, it's an extraordinary um, venue. It's, it's made up of a composite yeah. of uh, different cloisters from France, mm -hmm. uh, from the 14th and 15th centuries. And it's, uh, it's just really poetic. And I, to me, that's the sort of pinnacle of the exhibition, because we've chosen fashions that relate directly to the chapels and the monasteries out there. And there's a real intimacy, you know, a, a definite sort of like emotive experience when you go to the Cloisters. Heavenly Bodies, Fashion and the Catholic Imagination. This has been the largest expedition for the Met Gala. Not only is it in the Metropolitan Museum of Art, but it's also here at the Cloisters. What I've loved about this is that you can get up close and personal with the pieces without a velvet rope and a guardman telling you to stop, you're getting too close. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you next time.